Hey, I just want to share some, uh, I guess some revelations that God showed me about November 8th. I was watching the election like the rest of the country and the world probably. And um, I had two prayers going. I said, God, don't let the criminals win. And God showed the truth because I knew that at some point people were going to be uh, trying to rig the election for whatever reason. I didn't even know about Donald Trump. Uh, being uh, a good man, or I didn't know anything about him, and uh, but during the uh, November eighth election, I mean, there was a good seven eight hours where I was watching on TV and I was in prayer uh, as I was watching it, just in two prayers, like I said, and I didn't know anything about him, and at some point, the Spirit of God let me feel that he himself, Jesus, uh, stepped right into D.C., into the White House. And um, and I, when I felt that in the Holy Ghost, I knew that uh, Donald Trump was God's man. So no, nobody told me that. I just figured it out. God showed me. And uh, I thought that was pretty interesting. I mean, there's a lot of other, other details... Um, I don't know what I'm going to go into right now, but, uh, I mean, that's the main one. Um, I got, I'm looking at my notes for, uh, November 8th. It says the blue wall, Shofar Joshua 6, ram's horn, carried by priests. Shofar is gathered on November 8th. Quotations. He just broke through the blue wall from news. Um, Netanyahu to meet Taylor as a prophet. That's Mark Taylor, I believe. Um, now, if you know anything about masonry and them inverted pentagrams of satanic occults, there's a huge one that's pointing at the, uh, I guess the bottom point is sitting at the at the White House, if I understand that right. Um, and that point is is where Satan sits. Now, when I felt what I felt on November eighth, <laughs> uh, that was Jesus giving Satan the eviction out of D.C. out of that White House, and um, so. You know, there, there's things going on that aren't, you know, God's not just just revealing this stuff to everybody. So I, I do feel, you know, an obligation to share what, what I know came from Him. No doubt about it. So, um, but uh, others have said that the uh, Luciferian reign is over. And you know, I I kind of I have to agree, man. It's a I I see and I feel the same thing, you know. Um, somebody wrote uh, I wrote down a quote: "Luciferian reign ended." No, actually, I don't know if I wrote that, <laughs> but I, I know I heard other people talking about it. But Luciferian reign ended began officially November eight, twenty seventeen. Um, Jesus literally spiritually stepped right into Washington D.C. The actual proof, even seen as early as now with the vast bull stock market. Okay, let's get into other stuff. I'm just kind of skimming through my my multiplicity of notes. They're like scrambled eggs. Everything goes everywhere. So I got to just kind of... So, I mean... For right now, that's that's all I'm going to share. Um, but I'm going to be making other um, videos on the different revelations or things that God has showed me. Um, okay, that's all. Bye. God bless you.